This has been a fun concept so far. It's supposed to be an anti-mosquito circuit and I didn't have much hope for it <laughs> when I thought about making one, but I thought I would. Here's the circuit diagram. And the thing is that straight away I've got a bit of a problem. I used the exact components that were called for, the S8550 transistor and such. The only change has been to add an LED to know when it's working because of course if people can't hear it how are you supposed to know if the circuit's running except using an oscilloscope every time you take it outside. So anyway, the big problem is though, I can hear this no matter what I'm doing. So there we are, those that can hear cathode ray tubes or possibly anybody can hear that's running at about 12 kilohertz, something like that. Now the tone can be changed, the frequency can be changed by changing that capacitor. So I put a larger one on and that was well the one that was actually called for and it was even lower. I put a 471 on there at the moment and it's still audible. Alright, I've dropped it down now to a 121 and we'll see what the frequency is. Yeah, I can still hear that. Right, and now we're down to just 15 PF. So I've either stopped the circuit oscillating or I can't hear it anymore. I'll be interested if anyone can, so I'll switch it on. So, can anyone hear that? Let's go and try it outside. Right, so, I've brought the circuit down here and the clippers because I wanted to remove this tree yesterday. But I kept being attacked by mosquitoes, hence the build. Let's see what happens today. Well, I'm happy to report that with a bit of pruning, that tree started to lift itself and hopefully will continue to. But I can walk right underneath it. Main thing is, I've been attacked by I think one mosquito in that time, It'd normally be about 20 or somewhere. Let's have a look down at the actual stream. <laughs> the stream which is sort of starting to dry up somewhat, it is still flowing, but there are a heck of a lot of mosquitoes down here. So we've got the circuit, I'll hold it near to me in case there's a range thing and we'll see what happens. Yeah, you can see one on me. So back in the house now and this summary being, unfortunately it didn't work. I didn't expect it to, I thought it might do something. I think it was just wind really. That, uh, why I was able to prune the tree. So do you know which frequencies might work? Or indeed if the idea that these frequencies do upset the things is complete bunkum, <laughs> do tell me. But it was worth a little go, worth a little try. Alright, thanks very much for watching.